Getting started in Construct 2, making a quick platform game. I'm in Construct 2 here. File, New. We're always going to go with New Empty Project. That's going to give us this. If I just zoom out, you can see this is the layout that we're going to put our game into. The dotted lines here are important. That's the what you actually see on the screen when you first fire up your game. We will be able to go beyond the bounds of that, but this is the initial area. So let's put our game into here. Zoom in a bit. So I'm going to start by putting a sprite. Double click. Add a sprite. Just about everything that you see in the game world is a sprite. Insert and then click where I want it to be. I'm going to draw a stick figure man. I'm going to make him uh, face to the right because that's going to be the direction of travel. Eyes, hair. Happy with that. It's way too big, so I'll just take him down to size. Uh, he is currently called Sprite. We should call him something more indicative of what he actually is. I'm going to call him Player. It's really important you do name things as you go along, otherwise you end up getting yourself really confused. So we're going to add another sprite for him to land on. A platform, I guess. Uh, ground, maybe. I'm just going to use the Paint Bucket tool and give him some green ground to walk on. So that will be underneath like that and I'm going to give that a name as well which is going to be I'm going to call it ground just to save confusion from platform so I need to if I hit play now nothing will happen these sprites will just sit there and nothing interactive will be going on so I'm going to give them behaviors so if I click on my player and that's brought up his property sheet over here behaviors I'm going to add a platform behavior and you can see it's a little running man so he's now going to be controllable by the arrow keys left right and jump and gravity will work on him as well and my ground I need to make that something that he can interact with so again behaviors if I add in a behavior I could make it solid that would work uh, jump through is often a better experience for a game uh, makes it more fluid flows better so now if I hit play it opens up in the browser and I can jump around left right and it looks like a game obviously not perfect yet one thing you'll notice is floating slightly above the platform if we just hop back into construct 2 and I open up the sprite see in this toolbar on the left if I click on the collision polygon that's what construct 2 sees when it's doing interactions between objects and we can do better than that Best thing is to guess polygon shape. Terrible guess, but it gives us a starting point where we can then put in something. Doesn't need to be too accurate. This um, that's plenty good enough for most purposes. Yeah, that's better. Um, and let's just check how that looks. So yeah, a little bit better. He's now uh, not floating above the ground, and just to make the game slightly more interesting, I can hold down the control key and click on this and drag it and it's cloning me a bunch more which I can go over here and now I've got a bit more of a game going on where I actually get to jump and go as you can see there's a problem with me going over the edge there we'll work on that in the next video